Hey guys, it's John, and welcome back to my playthrough of Dredge. This is part six, I think, something like that. I kind of forgot. Um, we're pretty much wrapped up with the Stellar Base, and we just have a hungry dog that I don't know what to do with. And we have, um, still have to find the ring over here. Now, I'm recording this one back to back with the previous episode. So, cut me some slack. Ugh, blood snapper. Ugh. I'm gonna go back with uh, to the dog with a red snapper, cause like, uh, frankly, I'm not convinced that you can't just give it some some fish. Why wouldn't you be able to give it a red snapper? Especially with a fishing spot right next to it, which I think that's red snapper as well. Come here, buddy. We're gonna give you some, we're gonna give you some. Disembark. Continue sailing. That is so annoying. Small silvery fish. Wait, do they have to be silvery? Small silvery fish. Okay, now here's a shipwreck. Look at that. Ugh. Getting my sub mechanophobia right now. Okay, that's a barracuda. That's not a small silvery fish. These are also red snappers, aren't they? Do I have to find... Okay, wait. There's these. What about these? Okay, these are fang tooths. I'm just... Do I need to have, like, a specific fish? I just find that to be, like, extremely silly. If so. Um... Yeah, anyway. What about these things? Those aren't small I don't think there's small silvery fish around here. Anyway, okay, I'm gonna try to do this again during the day before I forget. Oh my god, it's already like two o'clock. Uh, at this point, I'll just do it tomorrow. <laughs> Time passes so fast here. Oh, research part back here, hell yeah. I'm gonna try to look for the shipwreck during the day in the middle of Stellar Basin. In order to do that, I've got to, um... Well, maybe I can do it before it gets, like, really... Generator... Okay. Activate the machine, yeah. Okay. Okay, let's go straight out to the middle of it. Okay. What's this stuff? What? That's it! Cause look, that's the ring! Relic discovered! I guess I just didn't see this when I was out here earlier. Oh my gosh. That's so frustrating. Cause it was too dark. Oh, did I get it? Sapphire earrings. Woof. Blood your girlfriend, woof. All right, so we are officially done here at the Stellar Basin. I'm just gonna go ahead and catch some stuff for fun. Oh, I finished my book, apparently. Wait, which one was it? 15% chance to not reduce fish stocks when catching a fish with a rod. And I think that stacks with what we already had, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, so what we're gonna do now, now that I've found the relic, we're gonna zip back. Well, we're not gonna do that just yet, actually. We're gonna, I was gonna say we're gonna use Manifest to zip back to the collector, just let him know. But, I want, I want to get to the bottom of this dog thing. This dog thing is driving me crazy. 
Because it's like, it wants to eat a fish. And I'm like, cool, I have a fish. Let's give it to him. And then it's like, not giving me any option or anything like that. Which is frustrating because it feels like it's hinting that we're able to, to interact with him in a certain way. But we're not. I don't know. Okay. Here, I'm going to do it. I'm looking it up. Full disclosure, full transparency. If you've been watching my Baldur's Gate 3 playthrough, you know that I do this. Okay, dredge dog fish. Um, dredge lost dog pursuit walkthrough. Ugh, game rant. Ugh, I hate game rant. They always give you this like long-winded introduction first. Lost Dog is a pursuit in Dredge that players can initiate by interacting with the stray dog on the east side of the island in F2. This pursuit centers around finding a home for the canine. Oh, I didn't know that. While it's not mandatory that fans complete this quest, there is a reward for doing so. Can you please? They've been, I swear they've been using AI to write this shit for like 10 years now. No human being writes like this. This complete walkthrough of Dredge's Lost Dog pursuit is here to help. You sound like ChatGPT. You are ChatGPT. Like, there's no way you aren't. Okay. Upon locating the dog, players must work to gain its trust by selecting a series of dialogue options. Okay. Throw some fish toward the dog. I don't even, I just get, I just get the dialogue disembark. Throw some fish toward the dog. Okay. Well, but how do I do that? Okay, I'm going to search dredge dog disembark because it's the only option that I have. Okay, I'm going to search dredge dog disembark Reddit. Somebody will somebody will say something. Like, let's see. I don't understand. Is no one having this issue? Okay, let's go over there right now. Right now. Going towards the dog right now. You know what? I'll catch, I'll even catch a little octopus first. There we go. I'm gonna try to catch multiple. Here we go. Let's catch one of these. No, no, let's catch, oh, yeah. One, two, three. Okay, so we got a coral grouper and we've got a glowing octopus. Let's get a red snapper now. And I'll even get a barracuda for good measure, okay? Cause they're plentiful right here. Okay, so we got a barracuda. These are like all the different fish that are available around where the dog is. Hi, doggy. We're getting something for you real quick. Even though I've had the red snapper in my inventory and it's been like, it acts like I got nothing. Ew, we don't want that. Thanks for the aberration. <laughs> okay, so we got four, we've got four different fish. I know an octopus isn't a fish, okay? But for the purposes of the game, it's a fish. Okay, so now. There's a skinny brown dog. Continue sailing, disembark. Oh. Oh my god. Disembark means get off the boat. I was sitting there like, it's very strange to me that there's two options for leave. Disembark to leave a ship, aircraft, or other vehicle. For some reason, I was thinking disembark meant we are, we are about to disembark. We're about to leave on the boat. But I guess that's embarking. I'm so annoyed right now. 
Oh, you guys are probably gonna be so obnoxious about this. I was telling him that last video. <sighs> okay. Ugh. We love the uncut videos. Now you can't cover up your mistakes. Throw some fish towards the dog. You throw some scraps in the water near the dog. It pounces at the splash and swallows seawater. Okay, not the brightest. Call for the dog? The dog wags his tail briefly but doesn't move. Slowly approach. You wade towards the shore. As you get nearer, the dog backs up a little ways. It sits. Um, call for the dog? Make soft, encouraging noises, and the dog cautiously approaches. It stops just out of your reach. Hold some fish out in your hand. You want some fish scraps in the palm of your hand. The dog approaches slowly, and but soon begins licking at them. Pat the dog. You reach out and gently pat the dog. Its eyes follow your hand, and it seems to understand that you're not a threat. Pat the dog. You pat the dog again. Seems to be enjoying it. Pat the dog. Seems to be enjoying it. Yeah, oh yeah. We're gonna pet the dog over and over again. Okay, so now what? You make your way back towards the boat. As you're waiting out, you hear the sloshing of four legs cutting through the water. You stop and turn around. The dog is standing a few paces behind you. It tilts its head questioningly. Let it follow you. Shoo it away, monsters. Let it follow you. You continue this time with the dog alongside. Its tail is wagging so hard it beats the water into a froth behind it. When you get to the boat, you turn around to pull the dog on board. Oh my god, I'm glad I have space. Oh, look at it. It's curled up asleep, opening an eye occasionally to watch you move around the boat. I like the idea that it just like curls up and lets you do this. You lift the dog onto the deck. It walks around briefly before curling into a ball and looking up at you. Maybe you could find this dog a more permanent home. <gasps> let's take a, let's take them to the researcher. Um, do you mind if we just, like, get a couple of pieces of lumber? I'm sorry, okay? Oh, re oh! Research part, sorry. I don't want to do this for too long. I just want to get two of them. No biggie. actually get one more if I wanted to. Getting greedy. Greedy survivor mans. Okay. You know what? Let's go let's go to the researcher. Cause she's the only one around here. Frankly. It's over this way. We have precious cargo with us. I give you dog. Hello, this dog needs a home. Do you want it? A dog? Oh gosh, let me see. The dog bounds over to the researcher. She crouches down to pet the dog, grinning. The dog licks her chin in response. I could definitely take this one off your hands, and I'd love the company. Are you sure? Yes. <gasps> yes, thank you. Oh, we're gonna be such good friends. He can be my assistant. Suddenly the dog stands upright and begins to retch, its stomach heaving. Seconds later, it vomits a wet glob onto the floor. Something glistens through the mucus. Ugh. Oh, uh, that's interesting. I suppose that's yours if you want it. A ring? I can clean the rest up. Don't worry about it. Oh my god. That's crazy, bro. Let's get the massive crab pot. I can't wait to get all these, these crab pots taken care of. Okay. Um... Great, dude. Uh, I'm glad that we did that all for a sapphire ring, but more more importantly, for a clear conscience. Honestly.
Whoa, what's this? Hmm, I've already caught aberrations, but... Ooh, a radiant squid. I don't think I had that before. Nice. Okay. I'm gonna go sell these. And then we're gonna manifest back to the collector. Oh, shut up. Get in here. And we'll be done with the stellar basin, at least for now. Um, might come back at some point. I don't know. We'll, we'll do this. There. Should I buy this massive crab pot? I've got money. Might as well. All right, and, oh, well. Let's rest. And then let's go back to the collector. I don't, I really, that really stresses me out. <laughs> that it explodes our ship. It does have a sandy, um, uh, negative con drawback. Took me a second to think of the word. You walk in and place the jewel encrusted ring on a tail by the collector. His eyes widen. Okay, I got an achievement. It's, it's interesting that it says entrust the ring. On the achievement is what it says. It says entrust the ring. We're certainly making excellent progress now. And I know what you're thinking. An item like this would fetch a fortune at any auction. But for us, its value transcends material wealth. Regardless, you are due a reward. He opens the crimson book, its spine cracking audibly. Selecting a page carefully, he begins to read aloud. The words sound muffled, although as though he's speaking through a thick haze. Ability unlocks banish. Fire off a blazing light that dispels and protects. You hear a growling, crackling in your ears. Suddenly your vision flares and both of your ears pop. He closes the book. We must keep searching. I've been thinking more on where we might find another. I can imagine all manner of detritus swallowed by the silty muck of Twisted Strand's channels. It's worth investigating. I'll mark a location on your map where you can begin your search. Okay. What will you do once you have all the relics? I'm starting to become interested in that. He ponders for a moment. Hmm. It's surprising, isn't it? The attachments we hold towards simple objects. But they are anything but simple. Seemingly mute articles can speak in different ways. If I showed you a childhood toy, you would be awash with forgotten memories. They hold the power to recall what was once lost. They hold the power to recall what was once lost. Are you trying to bring somebody back from the dead? Like, um, wife, husband, Child? Pet? <laughs> hmm. Maybe just your smartphone. He lost his keys. What do you think about, or what do you know about the old mayor of Little Marrow? What do you think about him? What do you know about him? Why are we asking about him? That stuttering old fool. Yes, I knew him. He'd join us on the water sometimes, but was more a hindrance than help. He never seemed entirely with it. I can't imagine he has fared too well since I last saw him. Okay. Okay, I got, I got this. Um, we'll go ahead and rest until dawn. What do you do with the workshop? I find, I, I keep expecting that we'll find it open when we come back, but we don't. Hmm. I'll go ahead and just like catch the shark real quick. Ooh. Yeah, trophy. Now I noticed that anytime I get like an upgrade like that from the collector, I come back and the lighthouse keeper has got something to say. So I'm wondering if that's the case here too. The lighthouse keeper approaches you on the dock wearing a questioning expression. You must have been around most of the islands by now. Have you found whatever it is you're looking for? I'm just fishing. She recoils from your flagrant lie. 
Why do you mistrust me so? What have I done to warrant such suspicion? She turns from you, shaking her head and muttering. She heads back towards the lighthouse. Well, I don't know. I mean... Oh, hey, sorry. Actually, I was... For some reason, I was going to sail towards the lighthouse. I don't know what you're talking about. What is it? I've been finding relics for the Collector. <sighs> relics? Collector? I'm not sure what you're hoping to achieve with this character. Do you even know? Have you stopped to consider it? Okay. I feel like there's some sort of, like, decision being made here, like... Maybe behind, um... Ooh, Twisted Strand, that's where we go next. I want to go to the Devil's Spine, though. Should we go to Steel Point? I forget what's up there. Anything good? Oh, let's go to the Trader. Screw that. I'm trading stuff. Like, there's two sides. Do you side with the Collector or the Lighthouse Keeper? But the Lighthouse Keepers don't really give me anything... Like, any information. I guess... I guess the other guy isn't either. Oh, I've got to sell my Bronze Whaler. Okay, um, sell, 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 do we sell the sextant to you? I guess so. Um, sell, okay, and I'll keep the anchor flag, let's give that to the painter, deliver flag. Do you find a scrap of fabric? A unique design, you want to touch it now? No. Can you paint my boat? Oh, um, paint the hull. Oh, I thought we had to find, like, some... Oh, sharp mint. You need to bring me these crabs. Malignant pincher cerebral crab. What the mm -hmm. hell? Okay, do, uh, rusty red. I need to prepare my brushes. Okay. Can you paint the roof, please? Can you paint it? Red as well. I'm gonna have a red bow. Hmm. Okay, cool. For some reason, I thought you had to, um... Get stuff delivered to you first. Adjust bunting. Bunting off, bunting on? Oh, I see. Thanks. Cool. Okay, I'm gonna sell... Uh, I'm gonna sell my my bronze whaler, and then we're gonna start heading towards the twisted shroud. But first, I'll go to Steel Point. See how she's getting on up there. I have a feeling she's not really gonna. Oh, 133 dollars. I'm glad I did it. Uh, let's see. So like, do you have... So the Tungsten Floodlight is like the best light that we have right now. But that's until we get more uh, light spaces, correct? Let's check out the dry dock. Is there anything that we can... Okay, light space. Oh, here we go. Oh, I need scrap and I don't have scrap. Uh, well, you know, I could just deliver some wood real quick. It's not a big deal. I need to get scrap. Holy shit. I can deliver all the wood for this. Yeah, if we find scrap, I, need, I really need that. Oh my gosh. There we go. Okay. And, well, we might as well take this, too. Thanks. Alright. Alright, yeah, let's go to the builder, and... Because I forget what she does. I thought she, like, offered a service for, uh, for me. Am I... Am I wrong about that? Take a look over here. Oh, is this scrap right here? Oh, hell. Well, let's get this. Why not? We'll make our way over to the the trawling depths or whatever it's called. Stra twisted strands. The tr the trawling depths. Hmm. 
Okay. I'm coming out. What is this thing? Okay, I didn't know you were still out at night. Okay. What services do you provide, Mom? Huh? Oh, okay. You actually don't. I couldn't remember if, like, there was, like, a service that she provided or if it was just, like... She, I think she gave us that book, and that was it. It seems like that's what you mainly get for doing side quests for people, is like, they give you stuff to read. Sometimes they even give you a book that they wrote themselves, which is kind of cringe, but... Oh, shut up. So annoying. I can get another one. Okay. Okay, let's get another one. There we go. Um, right. So, can we just manifest back? Here, I'll I'll rest to get my sanity back, okay? Oh wow, that really didn't. Okay. Let's go back and um, see if we can make a couple upgrades, and then I'll leave. I'll go to the Twisted Strands. I promise. I'll, I'll make it there. This, this video. Scout's honor. Okay. We just gotta get the upgrades. Okay, what, which one is it? Oh, this one. Okay, yeah. There we go. So now we got another light space, which I wonder if that will help us get a better light, because I would love that. But what light is three slots, you know? Four new cargo spaces. Oh. Not quite what we need. Ah, oh, come on, I need one more scrap. And then, yeah, let's see, so two wood, two cloth. Right, I've got another cloth here. Let's let's just get this out of the way then. Okay. Fifteen hundred dollars for that one. Yeesh. Okay, let's see if she sells better lights now. She does. Incandescent array, forty meters. But like I don't understand. I don't... I'm not sure I get it. Um... Do I have another light in here or no? Oh, the sampling device. I can sell that, can I? Can I sell the sampling device? No. I can't. Can I sell the hydraulic rod because I don't need it? Yeah. Okay. Um. Oh, repair. I just wonder if I can. Okay, if I get the cloudy lens. And I put it there. That makes it brighter. Okay, so that's what I can do with it. Got it. All right. I, I'm, I feel better about that. Yeah. All right, let's go. Feeling good. Let's head to the Twisted Strand.
Um, I'm going the wrong way. I need to go over here. There we go. Is there anything over there? Hmm. Let's keep going this way. Yeah, okay, so there's steel point right there. We're gonna go to this area right here. See if there's anything good. I'm excited to explore again. What the hell are these? It's a black fin tuna. Okay, we caught a couple of them. New area. Now, I, I assume this is part of the Twisted Strands area over here. You pull up alongside a boat at anchor. There are signs of life on board, but nobody appears to greet you. Call out? Almost immediately, a small slot in the door snaps open. A pair of frantic eyes peer out at you. Who goes there? A fisherman. What do you want? I was just checking to see if you're okay. Do I seem okay? No, I am very much not okay. I'm supposed to be delivering this package to Little Marrow, but I'm being stalked. A huge leviathan lurks in these deep waters. I've seen it. It hung in the water, its gaping mouth just below the boat. Oh, he's talking about the angler that we've seen. It would have swallowed this vessel whole if I hadn't bolted for the shallows. I'm not going any farther than this accur with into this accursed island chain. I could deliver the package for you. You would? Well... That would work, I guess. It's dense, damp, and very sticky. I wonder if it's gonna... be time sensitive. The courier pushes a lumpy brown package through the door hole. It squelches slightly as you take it into your hands. Dark fluid oozes from one corner. Thank you, stranger. This is bound for the dock worker at Little Marrow. I'm not sure what's inside, but... Listen, I know this sounds crazy. Sometimes I think I can hear the faintest of whispers coming from it. What is the dock worker up to? Now, I'm not supposed to be transporting live goods. Don't have the equipment for it. So just be careful with this thing, whatever it is. Here, why don't you take this too? Again, an item emerges from the door hole. This time, a book is pushed through and thuds onto the deck below. You pick it up. I'll be on my way whenever the coast is clear. Safe travels. I am so tired of getting reading material. Getting over it with mind and body. So this is a reference to the, uh, the game. Getting over it with Bennett Foddy. I believe is what it was called. Deliver the package. Okay. I mean, I'm happy to do it. What's this over here? Okay, might as well get this. Give it to the trader while we're over in Little Marrow. There's nothing else to do there, so... Broken Monocle? Are you serious? That's it? Let's get this too while I'm here. Oh, cool. Broken chain. Nice. Another dredge? Another broken monocle. Absolutely terrible. Let's go over here. I think there's like a... What is this? It's a serpent flag. Oh. Oh my god. Stop. Oh, you are so irritating. Okay, let's head back. Oh, it's we're, we're back into Marrow's waters because those were arrow squid. Oh my gosh. Some more eels. Oh. Ew, voltaic grouper. 
Might as well get some to sell, you know. Um, I think we have room for one more. Yeah, if we move this around, yeah. Oh, come on. Another one. Um, we actually can make room for it. No problem. Really? Okay, well, I'm sorry. There's no more room at the end. Holy hell. Okay, here we go. Okay. The dock worker. There you go. How's the day treating you? I've got a package here for you. A delivery, eh? Oh, it's a big one. Let me see. He takes the large package and examines it gently with his hands. He lifts it to one ear and listens for a while. He seems satisfied. Much appreciated, friend. Now, if you'll excuse me, wish me luck. He turns and hurries off down the dock without another word to you. Or compensation. What, are you gonna eat it? The traitor. Okay, uh, yeah, sell all trinkets. Thanks. And, you know, I'll give the serpent a little bit of flag. All right, fine, I'll scrap a fabric. You know what? Give me that one, yeah. I want the serpent. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna go sell this, um, stuff. These, uh, so-called fish that I'm carrying, and, uh, and then we'll be, then we'll be on our way to Wizard's Strand. Okay? I promise. Sell all fish. Thanks. Okay, now, now for real, though, we're going. And we're not gonna let anything stop us this time. If, so, if we encounter somebody and they're like, can you take us to Little Marrow? We're gonna be like, too bad, so sad. Screw you, goodbye. Yeah, that's right. It's my villain era. Oh my god, what is this? <laughs> I'm immediately distracted and stop. All that's left of this boat is an old husk. You pull a little closer. Okay. Okay, first of all, research part. Wow, this is great. I could have used this like earlier in the game, you know? Okay. No, but seriously, let's go north. Now, we can actually sail past that straight to Twisted Strand if we want. Um, we'll just head to the northeast. Here we go. Oh my god, it's the orcas again. You know, the first time I thought you were cool. Ooh, viper fish. I just want to get another one. Ah, uh, you know what? I want to get a viper fish aberration because I imagine that would be just gross. Uh, we just got we just got a bunch of regular ones. Huh? Blue mackerel, really? We're almost there. Let's see what this thing is. Oh, it's more of those things, which I've already found. Now, where? Okay, right here. This seems to be the main point right here. So let's go towards it. Oh, dolphins. Don't scare me like that. Well, these, ooh. Gray mullet. Yeah, we'll just, uh, see if we can catch an aberration here.
Really? We are not catching any aberrations here. Ah, oh, knock on wood. We got entwined mullet. Twisting, twitching tendrils sprout from the gill plates of this little fish. They heave in unison, moving the fish against its will. Oh. Okay. Oh, is this just the, the, the traveler, a merchant traveler? I love the sound of rain against the roof of my cabin. Is there anything better? Yeah, there's a lot that's better actually. Okay. Hey again, come by for a chat? What can you tell me about Twisted Strand? Not much to be honest, I've gone inside just the once. I sailed into that lagoon behind us and saw I could go left, right, or straight ahead. Mm. Something about the place seemed off. Through the fog, it looked like the trees were moving. <laughs> Can't explain it. I turned around and sailed right back out. I sometimes use this spot to rest up for a few days. The sunrises are particularly striking against the haze or through the haze. Never do any regular business here, of course. Is there something else you want to talk about? I guess not. Hmm. Let's see. No repairs we need. We can buy explosives. We can buy research parts, which I might want to at this point. Like... To cargo. Okay, I've got two research parts. Let's see if we can get. There we go. Reinforced crab pot. So this lasts for nine days. Capacity is six by five. Aberration bonus plus eight percent. The most durable crab pot ever constructed. Just make sure you return to collect your haul before something else does. It yields three per day. Now we can get three research um, parts for that thing. And then once we do, we can sell all the rest of our crab pots and just have a bunch of those. Because that's what I'd like to do. Uh, yeah, let's catch some Z's. I'm just going to sleep until the morning. And then, yeah, let's go. Let's explore this. Oh, whoa. It is pretty foggy, isn't it? Ooh. -hoo -hoo. Hey there. Oh, these are mangrove fish. Sergeant fish. Nice. Oh, what the hell? Oh. Holy hell. Oh my god. Gray mullet. Okay. Well, first of all, my sanity is crazy now. Wait, I can't leave. Oh, can I? Oh, no, I can't, I can't, I can't. Okay, well, that was interesting. Something slithers into your cargo hold. Oh, it infected the gray mullet. Well, who cares? I'm just gonna sell it anyway. Yeah, you're gonna buy it, aren't you? That's what I thought. Um, let me just put in some, uh, sorry. Yeah, some wood would be good. There we go. So I need two cloth, three wood, one scrap, two scrap. Okay, got it. Uh, yeah, let's rest until, there we go. Eesh, all right, so avoid the sanity dips. Ooh. I got a gar. Garfish are crazy. Okay. Tarpon. So what's this over here? Okay, I can go to the left. 
Now, it was blocked off before. If we want to get to the center... Something tells me that's just, like, blocked off right there. Um... Okay. Touch the stone. Yeah, it does not... It doesn't do anything. Maybe I have to be, like, insane to have it do anything to me. Okay, more garfish. We don't need more of those. Hmm. Let's go. Can this, can this be blown up? Yeah, I think it can. Debris. Okay, now back here. I go straight here. Oh. Where am I now? Okay. Ooh. It's a catfish. We got another message in a bottle here. Okay, so if I come in with explosives, I can just like blow everything up. Let's check out the tattered uh, receipt. Goldsmith and Son, number 27, Little Marrow, received the sum of $50.00 in exchange for one silver necklace with emeralds on silver mounting. Additional notes, received a further $3.00 for custom engraving on reverse of mounting. Customer to return tomorrow, 23rd of December, for collection. Engraving is to be as follows. For J, my shining star. Okay. Alright, yeah, we already caught the catfish. Ooh hoo hoo. What the hell? Longfin eel. Okay. So if I go through here. Wondering if there's a way out of here that's safe. Um, okay, I've already caught these things. Uh, check this. Okay, the longfin eel. Um, okay, so I went in right there. Um, well, I'm wondering if I can go this way or there's something, actually, there's something over here. It looks like it might be a message. Message in a bottle. Oh. The hell is it? A mortar frame? Hmm. Okay. Interesting. Oh, is this scrap? Oh, I don't think I can get it. I'd love to, but I don't, yeah, I don't think I can. Let's see, if we go around this way, then we'll, oh, what's this? Yeah, I guess I'm not insane enough yet. Okay, again, I need explosives for that. Okay, we've caught that fish, and I'm continuing to go... Along the outside. Okay, I'm just gonna go. Something was behind me just then. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna keep trying to go towards the center. Is this where I'm going? Oh. Oh, okay. What the hell? Can't go in that way. Frustrating. Um, can I go out? I can go out this way. Okay. What was this? Campsite. Another campsite? You see a campsite. Some old fish are suspended on a spit over a fire that was never lit. A pile of fabric is gathered at the base of a large tree nearby. What is going on? Inspect the fish on the spit. 
Rotten fish hang from the spit. The fire below had been prepared. Someone must have left in a hurry. They always are leaving in a hurry. Check the bundle of fabric. A nest of rags lies at the base of the tree. Somebody slept here. The rags are covered in bark chips. There are symbols carved into the tree trunk above. There are three distinct sets of symbols. Look at the first set. There's a book symbol underneath the wave, and then an upwards arrow. A cloud hangs over it all. Five unfamiliar symbols mark the corners of a pentagram. The shape of a person is lying down in the center. Now let me look at the first set again. A book symbol. Like the book that the collector has. A book symbol sits above a wave. A downwards arrow points from the book down through the wave. So they're trying to do some sort of sacrifice with the book? Oh, that's what I'm guessing was happening with the pentagram, right? Let's rest. Get our sanity back. Interesting. Um, okay, now that I know that I can come in along the side back here. Okay. I wasn't sure if I had gotten that uh, fish before. Hmm. Do I have this thing? Oh, a tarpon, yeah. Well, that's fine. Okay, so if we go along this side. Oh, I think there might be something right here. Look, yeah, there's something right here. Oh, oh, crocodile, crocodile, crocodile. A mortar barrel? Look, dude, it's a crocodile. I barely avoided it. That's fun. Okay, well, I have got the quite, quite the hefty load for you. Phrasing. Um, just ignore that I said that. Let's put this in storage mortar barrel. Am I supposed to? Hang on a second. Can you combine these? Mortar barrel. Mortar frame. Hmm. Okay, maybe, yeah, maybe we're getting pieces of mortar? Here, um, sorry. Oh. Now, do you have, okay, we can get some packed explosives. And frankly, I'm gonna buy another research part, okay? Yeah, that's right. And it's going towards the pot, okay? Um, okay, now if there was one that I wanted to explode, where would it be? Also, let's take a look at the Twisted Strands fish. So we've got Gar, right? Oh, okay, wait. Let's play a lot. Okay, yeah, Gray Mullet, Tarpon, Sergeant Fish, Gar, Longfin Eel, Catfish. Okay, we don't know where that is. A pot, that's a pot fish. Um, that's a crab, yep. Yeah. There's only two that we haven't found in Twisted Strand, and then the rest are in Devil's Spine. How are there so many I haven't found? Open ocean. Not caught. Oh, blackfin, tuna, and viper fish are open ocean? Oh, I didn't realize that. There's the oarfish. Look, I mean, he's very displeased to have been caught. Same with the gulper eel. Oh, this thing's in the mangrove. This thing. Oh, the goliath tiger fish. Tiger. The goliath tiger fish. <laughs> it's the tiger fish. Sorry, I'm just. It's 
There's something over here. Hang on. That's a message in a bottle right here. Question mark? Question mark? Question mark. Okay, I'm... This needs to blow- oh! I'm, I know I'm- I'm- I'm doing it right here! Yeah! Oh, it's just like... Maybe I shouldn't have used it so hastily! Damn it! It's some refined metal. And then we're on the other side of this. How do I get there though? And to be fair, I haven't really tried. If I did try, I guarantee I would get there no problem. Just wait till I start trying. You stand no chance. Oh wow, okay. Um I like this area. It's really cool. Like kind of a swampy, grovey area. Ooh. We can get some aberrations here. There we go. Gleaming mullet. Ooh, 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 ooh. So is this... Oh, it goes this way. Ooh, dredge this, yes. This is a really easy one. Yeah, I see why it's a broken monocle. Okay, is it not... I thought this was, like, cut off earlier. What is this? A large man is watching you through the billowing smoke of a campfire, idly carving away at a wooden stake. He stands as you pull ashore. <laughs> Stranger, from that look on your face, I'd say you've encountered the local wretches. Take a seat. You join him by the fire. I've been trying to rid them of this from this accursed jungle ever since we wrecked here. The boys called them mind suckers. On account of them, well. Affecting the mind. They made us see things. Do things. I'd ask you for safe passage away from here. But not until after I've avenged my squadron. What happened to them? A number of us went down in the fog. Crashing into trees or ditching into the water. Those that survived rallied here under the boughs of this giant tree. But it offered us scant protection, stranger. Before help could arrive, our numbers quickly dwindled. Picked off by the fiends and the forest. I met a few would-be rescuers over the years, but none would help me in my fight. Are you any different to the rest? I can help. <laughs> I figured you'd be up for it. You... You have the look. Listen up. First, we need to find the lost piece of my squadron's mortar. I've, I found two pieces. We'll then use that to bombard the beasts. Mm. Other planes went down to the north and east, where we are now. I'll mark the possible crash sites on your map. You go and see what you can salvage. Hmm? How will you honor your squad mates? Mm. I've hung a few of their dog tags up on the tree behind me. Seemed fitting enough. Well, I've only got tags from the ones I... You must understand, I... I never found all their bodies. But if you happen to find any of their dog tags, I could add them to the tree with their brothers. Hmm. I have a number of mechanical doodads that you might find useful. Here, take this one. In good faith, I'll give you more for each tag you bring me. This is fun. I have like a little mission. Are there any shipwrecks around hmm. here? Shipwrecks? No, stranger. Anything that meets its end here, it's quickly swallowed by the silt. Tell me about the mine suckers. <sighs> Devilish creatures through and through. They'll stalk you along the waterways and emerge suddenly, screeching their terrible song. Yeah, I, I ran into one as soon as I came in here, actually. 
The first time it happened to me, I saw shadows of my squad mates reaching out to me in a feverish dream. When I finally snapped out of it, I was covered in bloody scratches. They must have sent me running through the foliage. Since then, I've done my best to avoid the fiends. Their senses seem to be based on movement, so move carefully. Ah, uh, that's everything. Okay. Let me take a look at, uh... Oh, Airman. Let's rest. Till dawn. That sounds safe. Okay, so... You said you were gonna mark spots on my map. But I don't see anything. So... Um, I mean, I've got, I've got some pieces. Find the lost pieces. Do I have to, do I have to get them out? Um, they can't be in storage, I'm guessing. I found parts of the mortar. That's the lot. Oh, that's both of them. Now I work on assembling the mortar. You can get started the next phase of the plan. <laughs> you may have noticed some contraptions in the lagoons around here. I have assembled those traps for the mine suckers. We just need to lure them in there. Once they're in, you see, I can fire on them with our new mortar, and that'll be the end of them. No more nightmares. <laughs> I'll mark the locations of the traps on your map. Got it? Um, I understand. So what's next? We need to make three special baits from different combinations of fish. What? Okay. This one takes three fish from the area to make. Oh, dude. I've already got a couple of these. You want me to fish? So I need a gar. Okay. Come back when you got all the rest. But, but, but it, it, it. You, okay, you take them. Okay. Second one? Are you serious? Okay, we gotta get a catfish. Catfish, gar, and two of the eels. Catfish, gar, and two of the eels. Okay. Where hmm. I put the bait? And one of the traps I've constructed in the lagoons that marked on your map. Okay. That's all for now. You want dog tags? Okay, and you'll give me a research part for each one? That sounds like a steal. Like, that sounds like a ripoff for you, okay? Let's get that straight. You're getting ripped off for this one. I'm, I'm robbing you blind. I need explosives. Okay. So, gar, catfish, and eels. Okay, we got a gar. I do want to dredge this uh, scrap real quick. Because I kind of need it. Nothing personal, kid. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just saying things at this point. Okay. Um, you know what? Let's turn around and just... I'll bring the guard to him. After I go sell this uh, aberration. Okay. Because we can do this. Easy. Yeah. Um, so, sell this first. Oh no, I sold the car! I meant not to do that. That's okay. Oh, we, we can get another one. Did you hear me just now? Oh no! I sold the car! No! 
<laughs> Got the upgrade. It's so boring to watch John play this now because he's not even struggling for resources or anything like that. He's just he's just spending all he's got two thousand dollars. He's fishing too much in the fishing game. Okay, we can find getting over it with mind and body. Okay, what'd I get? I wish that they had the latest book at the top. 15% resilience to panic. Pretty good. Okay, there's a gar right here. Where is it? There's always one in this... In this area. Catfish? No. Okay, yeah. Let's look around. Another gar. Would love to blow that one up. Okay, wait, this is back out. Oh, my bad. Wow. Way back there, okay. Damn, do you see it right there? Okay, if I get it to like... Leave me alone. Okay, that's not a catfish. My bad. Yeah, if you just wait, then it goes away. Here we go. Okay, so we got a catfish, we got a gar, we just need to get two of the eels. Is there anything else that we're supposed to get here? A large cage suspended over the water. Well, the trap with bait. All right, this is where the bait is. Where are we supposed to get the dog tags? Is that the plains? Okay, we got one of these. Okay, I've got enough to, to get the bait done. Um, see, like, is the... How do I get the dog tags? Okay, I guess they're not right there. Um It's just more of the stupid stone stuff. Sorry, I'm like annoyed about that. The wreckage of an old fighter. Look inside. Oh, <gasps> dog tag. And we got a research part. So not only are we gonna get one from him for finding this, the the dog tag for him, we're gonna get one for uh, just just being around, which is great. Um, I don't think I. Well, I think I could. Maybe. Yeah, we could dredge this. There we go. Can I get around? Let's just go. Oh. Okay, I gotta get back in and get to that guy. 
Alright, back here. Okay, now... I think if I keep going this way... Stop that! I think you go around... this side. Are these stale? Okay, the garfish is getting a little stale. Hmm. I'm just gonna go for it. What? Oh, come on. I decided to wrestle a bit. Go for it. He's back here for sure, right? Yeah. Wait, is this not it? Oh no! I sailed to the wrong X. I was like, this doesn't seem right. My, oh my God, I'm an idiot. They're all getting stale. Oh my god, it's right over here. No. Oh, this is so annoying. I went the wrong way. It's right here. Oh well, we'll see what we can do. I found some dog tags. Let me shoot. Oh, the gar's rotting. Mm. All right. Mm, thank you. I'll hang on to them. I'll hang them on the tree. Yeah, as promised. Okay, let's talk about banging the traps. Let's just do the second one. Okay. There we go. This should do it. I'll just mix these in. Here, load this into a trap. Then get well clear from it. When the trap springs, I'll fire upon it with the mortar. Make sure you bring back proof that the thing's really dead, yeah? Foul-smelling mixture of fish and something else. The airman said this should attract the beast to the in Twisted Shroud. I should be careful. Do you want to know anything else about the bait? Let's do... Will, will you take this? Oh, does it matter if it's, if it's rotting? Pungent bait. So this one's pungent. That one's fetid. Okay, and then this is reeking bait. Where hmm. I put the bait? Okay, so they don't need to go anywhere else. Okay, I'm gonna use like they don't need to be. They don't need to go anywhere like specifically. Okay, I got an achievement. Research all pots. Hell yeah. What next? Engine? Yeah, we gotta get engine. Um, Let's start researching the twin jet drive engine, I guess. Okay, so we've got all of them. Now let's, let's go around. Will we have time to do this? Yeah, you know what? I think we will. I don't see why not. Okay. Well, first of all... Let's just do the one here, okay. 
Load the trap with bait. Should probably move away. Come on, idiot. Ah, ha, ha. Oh. Nice. Oh, ho, ho. Inside is the obliterated corpse of a mind sucker. The airman will be expecting proof of your success. Oh, he'll be expecting it. Well, we'd best not uh, disappoint him. Okay, we can do all three of them. Yeah, let's do let's do this one over this way. The one that I accidentally went to earlier. I was like, oh no, it's over here. Uh, I believe it's to the right here. He's done it. Okay, it's probably the same thing as before, so let's just go ahead and uh, get an aberration here. What do you say? Trophy. Nice. Aberration. And we got it. Okay. Oh, I think there's still one there. Oh, is there? No, it's gone. Okay, we just got one more to do. What's this? Oh. Damn, that one's kind of nuts. Some ruby earrings. Holy hell. All right. Now we just got to get the last one. I might go ahead and just drop off the other uh what 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 am I doing? Is it this way? Yeah. I might just go ahead and drop off the first two carcasses. See, I don't I don't like it when it does that. Okay, let's Wait, I can't go there or there. Oh, now I can go this way. Frustrating. What the hell? Okay, let's go give him the two carcasses. Ooh. Eh, twin eels. Ew. Okay. Yeah, let's give him the two carcasses. And then we'll go get the third one. I have a creature corpse to show you. Mm. Let's see it then. You hand the tattered lump of flesh to the airman. It's almost unrecognizable. But you both know it couldn't have belonged to anything else. He pokes at it with his knife, testing the rubbery meat. He seems satisfied. Yes, this is one of the beasts. Progress at last. More to go, though. Oh, you have more? You drop the flesh onto the ground, and he gives it a few slashes with the knife. It wobbles a little. Another one taken care of. One remains by my account. Let's finish this. Okay. I agree. I'll look out for dog tags, too, um, by the way. I've only found, like, one wreckage that I can actually get to, though, which is kind of frustrating. Which one's this? Thanks, bud. Where's my aberration? What? No aberration on that one. Alright, well, like there's a wreckage right there. Can I get it from that thing, actually? I'll try in a second. Is that the one that the alligator was right by? Or crocodile? Oh, that was clearly a crocodile! <laughs> 
Who said alligator, but it was a crocodile. Who said alligator? It was obviously a crocodile. Someone doesn't know the difference, I guess. Let's put these away. Thanks. All right, I'm going back in. I know I probably should have like rested, but whatever. So is it, wait, can I go to this one over here? Like, is this not? I was just seeing if I could, I'm so annoyed by that. I was just seeing if I could get to it, whatever. All right, last one over here. And uh, then we're good. Okay, if we go. Oh, wow, I almost skimmed the side of it. Oof. Here we go. We should probably move out of the way. All right, we'll watch this one. You know what we've got? A sea serpent on our flag. This is a very impressive trap. Wow. I like how he just nukes it at the end. That's so funny. Alright, we got the last carcass. And now we can explore... Uh, as we wish. I'm pretty sure. Can we not? Now, oh, there's a crab over there. What the hell? Where are we? Yeah. So we're just looking for those planes, are we not? Oh, crocodile. Ugh, blistered tar pond. Ugh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Disgusting. I'm looking for dog tags. I thought you marked the dog tag locations on my map, but I guess uh, that would have been too much work for you. Nope. I already learned my lesson with that thing over there. By the way, if you're like, oh my god, can you get rid of the exclamation points? I'm so sorry, okay? It's just there's... There's so many. Oh, it feels like years since I've been warm. I do not expect him to write. I just need to know what he thinks of me from time to time. He must return. I have written him another letter. This will be the last one. Hmm. Oh, I found eight out of 10. I did not notice that. So I'm actually making like really good time with that. Let's see. I think the only twisted strand things I haven't caught, besides the aberrations, obviously, which the sergeant fish has a really cool looking one. The gar does too. Um, are crab pot ones. Yeah, so. I'll have to put out some crab pots. This is the, this is where I found the first one. Is it not? That's scrap. Yeah, I walked, I, well I walked. I sailed right up to it. Okay. I will look for another plane, but Ooh, get a We got to get an aberrant catfish. Are you kidding me? You're joking. There we go. That's a weird one. Nightwing catfish. Ah. Hooked barbels seek out prey in the twisting mangroves. A once sluggish fish given haste upon crimson fins. Fascinating. Okay, this goes outside.
Yeah, okay, is this... Does this have anything? Or is this where I found it? This one might be where I found the dog tag. You know what? Just tell me where the dog tags are. Hello, internet. Um... Dredge dog tag locations. Here I go. Yeah, just tell me just tell me where they are. Just tell me where they are. how many are there? I found one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's it's a good idea to to do this. Okay. Apparently, I drove right past them. There's this one, but then there's one back there that apparently I just missed. Uh, which one was it? It was like... This one. Do I go on the other side? There's four of them. But I've only got one. And this is where one of them is. Then what's the deal? Oh, you have to approach the craft from the correct side, is what it says. Okay, well now I can do the rest. I just needed to know that. So like... Are you kidding me? Wait, is this the one that I got then? Oh my god, you guys have no idea how salty I am right now. I'm like... Well, you probably do, actually, if you've been watching me for a while. So wait, didn't I get this one earlier? Okay. I got that one. This is... So annoying. I'm about to... I'm about to lose my shit. I approached it from the other side and I didn't get anything. I approached it from that side and I get nothing. I'll tell you what, I'm just gonna... Head back to the trading point. Okay, wait, there's this one, right? Okay, this one has one. The fuselage. Okay, I finally, I finally found one. You gotta be kidding me. Um... Literally can't pick that up. Yep, because I've got a damaged hull, but I got I got what was important. Something slithers. Oh my god. Stop! Stop infecting my shit! Oh, it's gonna take me a while to get to the stupid pontoon, too. Well, I'm glad I got the second dog tag, but I really should have three. I think we can all agree on that. No, don't you dare. I'm docking, I'm docking, I'm docking. Back off. I sold them all. Rest. Okay. And before we go any further, let me get this dog tag that's over here. The one that the... the Gata... is guarding. Because I know we can get it. Now how... 
This is the fourth one. How do you... How do you get it? It's not over there, is it? I don't know. I'm like... I'm like incredibly salty right now. Might as well call me a Pringle. Uh, well, stick me in queso and call me a Frito. I'm salty. All right. I guess we'll just give him this one. I don't know. It's annoying. Let's show him the creature corpse. Uh, he dropped a large bloody carcass from the airman. His eyes fill with sadistic delight. He bends down and plunges his knife into the soft flesh. It falls away before the blade, revealing a glint of metal. With a sickening tear, he rests it from where it was embedded in the flesh of the creature. He holds it aloft. You recognize it as a necklace glistening in gore. <laughs> well, fisherman, some fortune at last. This ought to fetch a decent price from the right collector. Here, why don't you take it? He stands back from the corpse. A melancholic look comes over his face. <laughs> and now, well, that's that, I suppose. Hmm? I found some dog tags. I found one. I wish I could find more. Hmm. Yeah. All right. Thank you. I'll hang on to them in the tree. I'll ha hang on. Hang them on the tree, rather. Hmm. What will you do now? I can't say for sure. I thought I'd be asking you for an escort away from this place, but this has become somewhat of an home for me. Doesn't feel right to leave my brothers here. I think I shall stay a while longer. In the meantime, I can make up some special bait for you in order to help with your fishing. I literally don't need help with with fishing, though. Pretty sure. Where's the Goliath tiger fish around here, though? Mm. Yeah, this was left over from the other bait we made. Mixed bait can be used to attract all manner of species. Toss bait overboard to attract local species. Right now, we can make some fresh stuff if you like. Mm. I'll need some fish from you first. Any type will do. But the more you give me, the more bait I can make. Okay, that's fine. I I don't really want that. Um, let's see. We're gonna go. Oh, I've already got the net, uh, nets. Let's do. Oh, I'm going after engines. Now I got the pots. I'm going after engines next, and then nets will be the last thing. That's like priority zero, frankly. Um, so yeah, I don't know where the Goliath tiger fish is. The last thing I want to do is I want to go over here. Um, and then we'll rest at the rickety pontoon. And then I guess I'll end the video. You are so annoying. Fuck you. I'm cranky. I need to go to bed. <laughs> Listen to me. I'm so cranky. Uh, I just, I drove through that thing over and over again, and everything was fine, you know? Let me just get this, just in case we run into, like, a Goliath tiger fish or something. Mm. Oh, your hole's got some damage. Yeah, thanks. Thanks, genius. Captain Obvious. Yeah, I'll just, I'll just... Rest until dawn. It's just easier that way. God, you rest for a long time. Mm. Do I have any fish? No. Ooh, let me buy the reinforced crab pot. You know what we gotta do. Here. You know what? Can I sell these to you? I want to sell all my crab pots. I don't. I don't. I don't want them anymore. Yeah, I don't want these, like, crappy ones. No. I don't even want the massive crab pot. Well. Eh. Okay. So, let's go ahead and... Is that the massive crab pot right there? Yeah, I'll come back and collect it. Okay. 
Uh, yeah, let's go off to the east. It looks like there's something over here. So I would look around. Okay. Oh, it's another plane wreck. Hmm. Do I need... Do I need wood for anything? Maybe? I might? Might as well get some, I guess. Whatever. Can you tell it's exciting for me? Okay, there's like a treasure over here. That's cool. A dog tag. Oh, okay. Cool. Oh, wait. There's something over here. There's like a boat. Ooh. This is a, a research part. Gotta play a Geometry Dash Demon level to get out of that thing. Damn. All right. Oh, what the hell? Oh, my God. You can't even see. What a poorly placed tree. Holy. Okay. Somebody's tricky. Okay. So, what's this? I mean, I guess I'll get it. Oh, it's a flag. A hook flag. Okay. Is that all that's here? No Goliath tiger fish. I mean, at this point, I got the first two really easily. The ore fish. And then the gulper eel. The gulper eel was just, like, there. That one wasn't even hidden. I'm like, are you serious? You couldn't find this one? It was like basically a gimme. And the orfish was like, well, it's behind the waterfall. I mean, do you really need someone to tell you it's behind the waterfall? You see a waterfall, you go behind it. Come on. It ain't rocket science. Ooh, let's check and see what crab pot stuff we have. Ooh, it's a horseshoe crab. An ancient species. Seriously though, horseshoe crab have been around for mm. an insanely long time. Let's go ahead and sell the fish. Uh, I've got a dog tag to take to him. Oh, I guess we could just do that, whatever. <laughs> um, Yeah, I think I've got... No, go over there. And let's get it. Okay, last thing I need to get is uh, two cloth. But, um... Let's see. Okay, yeah, whatever. Uh, I'm gonna just... I guess I'll just go deliver this dog tag, get the research part, and then we'll make the final upgrade, and then that'll be the end of this one. Which is pretty cool. Uh, can I still look at it? There's nothing for me there, though. A mangled mess of wooden wire. The trap itself was reusable. But not for being hit by a mortar. Yeah, I'd imagine not. Right? Doesn't sound like it. I do kind of want to blow up all of those uh, things around, you know? Be able to like move through the grove however I want to. Okay. Found some dog tags. Mm. Ah, thank you. I'll hang them on the tree. That's all of them. That's all of them? Really? Oh. Oh, I did get two over there. So the one I was like molding about missing, I'd already gotten. That I can remember anyways. I can't picture their faces too clearly anymore. Hmm? Give me some bait for me. Okay, I was kind of hoping that like... 
I don't know. I don't know what I was hoping for. There we go. Now we got the twin jet drive engine available. Now we just gotta get this thing, and then we can get this thing, which is gonna be sick. Pretty sure that's gonna be like the ultimate engine. We're gonna be zooming. All right. Um. Yeah, that's gonna do it for me. All right. Hope you guys are enjoying Dredge. Let's see what we got left to do. Would you say? I'm gonna just undock quickly to look at the map. So let's review what we've done. Okay. So, we've gone through the Marrows, we've gone through the Gale Cliffs, the Stellar Basin, and now the Twisted Strand, which we did all in one video, might I add. Like, half of the video, sort of. Long video. You know, whatever. Um, the, the main thing that I haven't done is I haven't done all these, like, little islands in between. Like, I, I haven't looked around these islands in between the Twisted Strand and the Stellar Basin. So, I'm thinking maybe next video we turn in the necklace or whatever. But then we we go to Devil's Spine, maybe in part eight, and then part seven, I can just explore, because there's so many fish in the open ocean. I was amazed looking at the Pokedex. There were so many that said open ocean, because I was looking through it and I was like, I've only got like 50 out of 150. How's that possible? And it's because there's tons of fish just out, I guess, just out here. Do you think there's stuff out here? Fuck, please don't. Don't do that to me. Not without any landmarks. I also gotta find that Goliath tiger fish. It's somewhere around here. But I don't know where. I feel like I've been everywhere inside the strand. And I haven't seen it. I've been over here. Been over here. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, it could be out here, maybe? We'll, we'll have to see. But, uh, yeah, I'm thinking maybe next video is just like an exploration video. And then maybe part eight we go to Devil's Spine. Because I think after that, I mean, once we get that last relic, things are going to start falling into place pretty quickly, I would think, for, like, endgame. I'm just guessing. So, like, look at the pursuit, right? Like, we got the necklace. Now all we need to find is the watch. And then once we get that, we bring it back to the collector. I'm assuming that's what initiates the end of the game, right? Um, I haven't done... I haven't found a snake mackerel. Where the hell is a snake mackerel? But yeah, I think, I think as far as objectives go, I guess all the objectives in the game fit on this one pursuit board. So according to my calculations, we've only got six left, seven maybe? Something like that. So yeah, we're, we're doing pretty good. But yeah, I want to go in the in-between islands next time. So uh, yeah, hope uh, you're having fun with the series and I'll see you in the next part. Think critically. Stop moving the camera. Stop it. Why do you move the camera until you get to a tree that blocks the view of my boat? Who... Who made the executive decision that that was to stop it? Literally, I'm not doing it. It's doing it. Stop doing that. Stop, why would you program the game like this? I want to see my boat. Okay, if we zoom in, that... I... I'm in disbelief. Stop. I'm not touching it. It's just naturally drifting. And then it's, it's like... Okay, what if we... How about here? Okay, we move it... Stop. Don't do that. Okay, at least we're high enough up to where we can see our boat. But if we zoom in even a little bit, then, then it becomes completely obscured. Okay. This is a great game. Okay, I love it. I love this game. This is a great game. I'm not criticizing the game. It's just a, it's a weird thing that they're doing. It's, it's a weird thing that they make the camera do this. Anyway, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.